What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Rick One Ball, coming at you again with yet another exclusive. Now, if you don't know what I'm doing, I'm making sure I cover each and every NBA game to provide you with up-to-date sports analysis, as well as my opinion on these games. With that being said, let's get into the game. Now, let's get into these Golden State Warriors versus Cleveland Cavaliers. I ain't got to say it too much. You already know what it is. Klay Thompson's return. Everybody was out in, in the Warriors organization to show their love and support for this man who's been out for two years with a, uh, with a knee injury and, and, and an Achilles injury. And Clay, you know, uh, Clay Thompson uh, played for 20 minutes and dropped 17 points. And let me tell you something. This is a scary, scary thing for the rest of the league because I, me personally, I'm not a Warriors fan. I don't even really like the Warriors at all, even watching them. But this dude right here dropping the buckets, the way he was dropping them, he struggled in the beginning. He he had seven points and uh, for a good while, and they, they were taking their time on him. And then now that it was looking like the Cleveland Cavaliers was were double-teaming him. I mean, even when he was missing shots, it was in and out. It was damn near looking like he, he missed one three-pointer. It was in and out. He got his own rebound, or somebody got the rebound, put it back to him at the three at the free throw line. He shot another one. It was it rolled around the rim. This dude looked like he's on point. My only critique of Clay Thompson: cut that damn afro uh, uh, off and put your fade back on, man. He looked like Will Ferrell from that uh, that one movie with that Will Ferrell played basketball. That's the only we thought I want to mention uh, that's not going to get a lot of credit and. Nobody really going to talk about it is Rajon Rondo for the Cleveland Cavaliers. I thought he played a good game, and he's a nice bright spot for them. Uh, after uh, Ricky Rubio went down, I thought uh, Rondo had some good plays tonight and showed a lot of energy and showed he can really still play basketball uh, tonight. Like I said, Clay Thompson dropped 17 points, and it doesn't even really, really, really matter what anybody else's total was because tonight was a Clay Thompson game. It's your boy Rick One Ball. Like, comment, subscribe.